Greetings and salutations folks, I'm Josh from Lazy Acres. Thank you for tuning in. We are saving the world here one trailer at a time. Today we're gonna to take a look at a 2021 Keystone Montana, model number 362RD. It's a dual bedroom slash rear den model with an outside kitchen, whole lot going for it, weighing 13,800 pounds. This is that secondhand sugar, and I'm here with my friend, that Dutch bad boy, Brennan Hannemeyer on the camera today. Brennan? What's going on, happy campers? Thank you so much for tuning into the number one RV YouTube channel in the world. Please don't look that up. If you don't mind hitting that like and subscribe button, we greatly appreciate it. We're on Instagram, TikTok, Facebook, and we're even on Pinterest. So you should check us out there as well. I really like this floor plan. I did when we had it new. Love it now. Love it now, eh? Great looking front fiberglass cap. The kind of black portion around the sides there is painted, which is great. We got LED lights built in, a road armor uh, rotating pin box, not rotating, um, Chucking. Articulate. It, pivoting. No, it's not pivoting. Pivoting head and controls chucking. I, I know, but I'm just trying to think <laughs> of a way to say this. Because rotating is kind of like this. That's what right. you say. Gnarly, man. <laughs> Gnarly, bro. <laughs> What's up? And then we got our generator prep in through here or just rougher style storage. And we're also going to have our battery and box location over there to the right. We got six point electric auto leveling on this model. A set of 30 pound paint tanks, one on either side, the controls for the leveling there. We've also got slide toppers on all four slides. Our pass through storage has great height in through there because it is a drop frame construction. We've also got our low point drains, gate valves, battery disconnect, tank flush, black water flush, secondary one. And then we have our city water connection, winter rising, outside shower, and the light. Furnace vent here, 12 gallon gas electric water heater. And then coming down the back side here. I like the frameless windows. They are nice, you're right, Brendan. 50 amp detachable style cord there. Class three receiver, four way wiring, outside shower, roof ladder, get up on your roof, check your seals every 90 days. And then here is our outside kitchen. So there's no sink, but we got ourselves a Montana cutting board. There we go. We got ourselves a little uh, two burner cooktop that's gonna pull out, it's finished off with galvanil. I always like having a microwave in the outside kitchen, three cubic foot or maybe a two and a half cubic foot electric fridge, and then cupboards here across the top. I like these doors too, they're like a metal kind of finishing through there, not gonna distort or kind of get uh, banged up on you. And then we have a secondary entrance here into our secondary bathroom. These are 16 inch tires, aluminum rims, road armor suspension. Our electric awning starts here, goes all the way forward down and through there. And then our secure steps, actually both doors have secure steps up into the model, lend a hand grab handle, outside receptacle, and then right here is just the other side of our pass through storage. You can see this side is a little bit wider, which is good stuff. Let's go have a look inside. Right on folks, we're inside that 362 RD Montana High Country. You're standing at the main door there looking in over top of our kitchen into our main slide. We've got theater seats in over here, a couple cup holders, reclining action, windows hall in behind the, uh, the, the theater seats as well. I'm getting distracted because I just saw dual pane windows, Brandon. I know, this thing's loaded. A lot of options on this, which is great. I've always loved these chairs on this model. They don't do this anymore. I'm actually uh, a fan of these chairs. I prefer them. They're nice and simple looking. We do have a leaf that's gonna, or like an extension that's gonna come out of the table and through here. Nice lighting across the top of the slide. And then across from the theaters, across from the freestanding table and chairs, we have our TV, our radio and behind our smoke glass, and then our fireplace put in down below there, putting in electric heat. <sighs> Love that. Beautiful. Big fan of that. Covered space here. And then here's our pantry space now. All right, down the side of the TV fireplace area. Okay. Oversized microwave. A cupboard here across the top. Three burner stove top underneath the glass stove top cover. Deeper oven. And then like a pot and pan drawer down below that. We've also got our 13 and a half cubic foot gas electric fridge. And then here's our island. So our island isn't massive, but does give us a little bit more counter space. We have a smaller sink on the right, larger sink over here on the left, which is great. Pull out faucet. And then down below, we got four drawers built in. Look at this. Bang. Tell your friends, baby. Cover space in through there for garbage can slash recycling. Uh, and then if you want to kind of swivel to that space there, Brendan, uh, we've got some additional pantry space over here to the left, which is awesome. What's well, up? if you're gonna bring it up, just finish it off, buddy. It's also laundry, uh, laundry prep. All right, receptacle, hutch in through here, <laughs> drawers. I'm which more are... of a hinter. Yeah, I know you are. I was hinting at the dual pane windows yeah. earlier too, and you didn't catch it. With the frameless? Yeah. Yeah. 
<laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Brian always jokes that he's like a troubleshooter. I'm a clever dad. <laughs> well, you get things done. Um, swivel door. What's that? Swivel door. Swivel door. It does make it difficult to film though. Video door. Sir, yeah. yeah. Uh, porcelain toilet here. We do have a cupboard down here for a garbage can in the bathroom. Drawers down the right hand side. Seamless counter, undermount plastic sink, shelf here, and then a medicine cabinet there. Great camera work, Brandon. And then the doors should be over there for operation. Nice seamless uh, shower in through here. There is a seat I can sit down and shave my legs. Good height on this model too, upgraded shower head. And then coming into the main bedroom, we got a queen size bed out in that slide. Windows on either side of the bed. Bedside tables, lights as well. And then a great look in front closet. We got hanging, a light above, a shelf above there. And then here is some additional storage. One of the things I couldn't do on this model was make this deep enough to put a uh, washer dryer. So if you're gonna do that, you have to do that in the kitchen. Like Brendan mentioned, we got two drawers here and then two large drawers down below, and then a spot right there to put a secondary TV. Now coming back through the living space, we still have that whole rear den, rear bedroom area. Because I have customers, Brendan, who use this differently, right? Oh yeah. So, you know, the kids back here, I, I, I kind of like the kids here because you get the two bunks, they're, they're out here chilling, and then they still have their own space to hang out in play their games, video games, whatever they're gonna do. Theater seats are over through here. Again, electric reclining with some cup holders, a tri-fold sofa here at the back. So if you have a couple coming with you, that'll pull out into a big secondary bed. We still got big windows around the back side, cupboards across the top side, TV across from the theater seats, OG manuals, cupboard, open shelf, cupboard, and then, and then into this bunk does lift up, like so you're not uh, hitting your head while you're watching TV. Uh, you mean the one above the theater seat? Yeah. Yes. Thank you, Brandon. We do have uh, another porcelain toilet in through here, seamless counter, another cupboard there, a shelf, and then an, even on the secondary washroom, we have a secondary medicine cabinet with a fantastic fan above us. That's the video, folks. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, hit us up at Instagram, Facebook, and TikTok. Leave us a comment down below. Have yourself a good day.